What's up everybody? This is KG. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the UB size 51 inch tripod. I ordered this off Amazon and it's supposed to be a tripod and a selfie stick in one. So let's open this up and see what's inside. So right off the back it comes out in this nice little case. Looks pretty, pretty good. And you can loosen it up. Inside, wrapped in plastic, is the tripod. And it also has some paperwork. And this is the little package that comes with it. And if you open it up, you can see here there's some instructions along there. And then if you flip it over to the back side, the instructions continue along here. And then it looks like it's going to come with some sort of a remote. And this is the instruction manual of how to use it. And I guess pair it and use it properly, right? Okay, so now I'm going to take the tripod out of the plastic bag. There we go. This is what it looks like out of the bag. And then also there's some small items that come out of here too. So this is that little Bluetooth camera thing. And let's open these guys up. So here's the first item. It looks like some sort of a mount maybe for a GoPro or something like that. It's a different type of mount. And then you got this thing which I believe is the mount for your cell phone. So if you look here it has some hinges at the ends here. Probably bends out, yeah. You can open it up like this and probably, yeah, you just pull it, see? Pulls along here in order to put your cell phones in. And of course, this is gonna be the piece that screws onto the tripod. So this is the top piece of the tripod here. As you can see, you can screw directly like a camera right onto there if you want to. And of course, if you wanna do your cell phone, you got the option of putting this guy on. So right off the back, I see this little lever here where you can turn your screw up here. This little thing turns it. So if I want to put on the cell phone holder, you can put it in and just turn this thing from the side. So I'm turning with my thumb right now and it's tightening. So it's already on here, it's tight now. So this can put my cell phone right away. So I'm going to test it out right now. I have a Samsung Galaxy S8 and let's see if it fits on here. Putting it in right from underneath, sliding it up, and sliding it on. And there you go, it's attached. You can see this, this is attached right onto here. So here, right away, selfie stick mode. Boom, click, 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 click. So I'm just gonna take that off for now. So that option works pretty smooth and easy. And taking this guy off, comes off pretty easy as well. And just for fun, I'll put the GoPro mount on here as well. Again, you can just screw it in with your thumb really easily and it tightens up, it's tight on here now. And you can unscrew it with your thumb right here again and it comes off. So putting things onto here is pretty easy. Now let's try and turn this thing up. So to move the top, you gotta loosen this little side screw here and then you can maneuver this thing back and forth wherever you want and it has little clicks in there so you can set it up this is like perfectly straight and then you can tighten it up so if you want it perfectly straight there you go so now to make this thing bigger you can see there's one two three four pieces here and I think this is the tightening and loosening for the bottom portion so let's first just open these four levers here they just kind of snap open so you can see they snap easily open up and this should allow this thing to start growing so you can see they all come out so they come out to whatever size you want and I believe once you have it where you want it just snap it close yeah it just quietly closes into position so there you go so this is already taking shape here's the bottom I'm going to loosen this part up and see I have it upside down right now. 
but you can see here this thing looks like it's gonna straighten out over here I guess you can tighten up the screw here then you have this thing standing on the floor so now I have this thing fully open and I'm gonna show you a full view okay what I'm doing here is giving you a full shot from ground to the top this is in the fully open position so I've opened up all the knobs and fully stretched out the tripod to its full height and full length I just measured it it comes in at 52 inches from floor to the top so that's a pretty good size for a tripod now let me come in close okay so these are the feet in the fully open position and I'm slowly gonna make my way up that's the first handle second handle third handle fourth handle and all the way to the top and that's it that's our full length tripod here okay the next thing I'm gonna try to do is pair this to my phone now on the back it has an area for your battery so let me make sure the battery's in there yep, there you go that's the battery so I'll close this back up now if you look on the side here you can turn this on you can see there's a little flashing blue light in there and on my phone I just turned on my Bluetooth settings okay and if you look on the bottom there there's UB size so let me click it I just clicked it and it says it's connected okay so it says once you're paired all you got to do is open up the camera in your phone and use this to click and it should take the pictures for you so opening up my camera so I'll set it up like you guys are taking a picture of me from your angle and I'll snap away there we go it worked yep and there it is that's the picture that I just took using the Bluetooth so the Bluetooth does work so the other feature with the Bluetooth is that it does auto recording as well so I put it on video mode let's see if it tapes me on video test right now oh there it goes yep so it's recording me now and this is our test video and I'm going to stop it right now Okay, I'm going to play the test video to show you that it came out okay. Oh, there it goes. Yep, so it's recording me now. And this is our test video, and I'm going to stop it right now. So, yep, this little Bluetooth thing is working just fine. Now I'm going to turn it off. Okay, so I brought back the whole thing right now. I just want to break it down in a little more detail. One thing about it, it's pretty lightweight. It's not heavy at all. It's a light metal in here. It definitely doesn't feel heavy duty and it also doesn't feel super cheap either. It's somewhere in the middle. It's, it's decent, right? I would definitely say this is a tripod you'd have to handle with care. If you accidentally step on this or something, it could probably break or bend. So I would say just be careful with it. But I would say the sturdiness of it is decent. It's not bad. For the price range that it comes in right now, on Amazon in Canada, it comes from somewhere between 32, 33 bucks up to 40 bucks when it's full price so it comes up and down it goes on sale and let's just say 30 to 40 bucks is right now the price for it in Canadian dollars now another interesting thing I'd like to point out the legs here can be set at different heights so if I loosen this little screw here you can actually play with this and if you want to set it at a different height you can tighten it and it will stay at this height so you can you can change it the other thing when you do want to open and close it is easier to turn it upside down and pull it up and down when you have it upright and you try to do it it's kind of harder you can do it but it's easier to just turn it upside down so if you are setting up your tripod in a tighter space you can give it a tighter triangle by pulling it up like this now I'll close it back up tighten the screw for the bottom of the tripod then I can open up all four joint points one at a time. So this is the first one, put it back, snap. Second one, put it back, snap. Third one, put it back, snap. Fourth one, put it all the way back, snap. And there you go, this is back to its small size again. So the ease with which it opens and closes is really good. I actually like it a lot. It's a very convenient and quick method of opening and closing a tripod. All the parts work great. So now I'm gonna mess around one more time with the cell phone holder. 
So let's open this up and put it back on. Okay, and let's slide my cell phone right back into there. Boom, it's back in. Okay, so here we go, cell phone's in. Nice and snug. So now if I wanna shoot widescreen, I can do widescreen shots here, no problem. Now what happens if I wanna shoot vertical? Can I do it? So let's test this out. So I'll loosen this guy up. Ooh, can turn him this way. So now he's pretty much 90 degrees. Tighten this guy back up. And then you gotta loosen this screw and turn him this way, right? So this is the screw to attach the cell phone holder part. Loosen it up, put it whatever way you want. And then you gotta tighten it back up. And then you got it this way. So you can take footage this way as well, right? You can even turn it back this way. And then you can do a selfie mode again from a vertical position. So it gives you quite a bit of flexibility. Now if you wanna take your shot from a little farther back, I'm sitting a little bit more cozy up in my sofa. So now I'm taking a further away selfie from here. So now if I'm sitting here and I wanna record, I can use my little Bluetooth thing here, click it to record, do a little vlog, blah, 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 blah. When I'm done, click it again over here and I'm finished. So it's quite convenient. It's very light. I don't find it heavy at all, so I actually like that a lot. And I believe this is pretty good bang for your buck. So I'm just gonna read you a few of the specs shown here on this little instruction manual. So it lets you know that there's a quarter inch thread hole which is the top of the tripod to hold your camera if you need to put a camera on there. And of course to attach the cell phone holder and also that GoPro piece that I had shown you earlier. And then it just tells you there's the five sections which basically says you can set it to various different heights as you need it. It also lets you know the phone holders meant to fit between 2.25 inches to 3.75 inch wide phones. So it says here it is an aluminum alloy tube, lightweight and portable. And I would definitely agree with that. It's very light, portable, and actually, I would definitely recommend this and say it is great as a traveling tripod. This would be great if I'm going on a vacation or a trip. I can see myself using this quite a bit. It's very easy to take with you. It also tells you the bottom is anti-slip rubber. Now lastly, in this fully closed position like this, it's almost 17 inches long. So one thing I notice is I don't see anywhere on this tripod where you could mount or clip this Bluetooth remote control. I don't see anywhere you can attach it. It does have a little groove in here meant for going on a keychain. So I guess you can attach it to a keychain and take it with you. So my final assessment on this, I would give this a solid eight out of 10. It's really good. It could probably be a little bit sturdier Personally, I think I would feel more comfortable if it was built a little bit sturdier, but it's not built badly. It's just that I feel like it's delicate, so I would have to be careful around it. And also, I would have liked somewhere that I could have clipped the remote control to when I'm not using it, so that it stays as part of this tripod. Would I recommend this? I haven't had much of a chance to use it yet, except in this video. I most likely would recommend this. It does seem really good. We'll see how long it holds up and how well it works over time. But based off my initial review, it is a decent product and I would give it a thumbs up. And that is my review on the UB size tripod and selfie stick. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please do so and make sure you hit the bell button so you're notified each and every time I post a new video. And make sure you share this video with all of your friends. We'll see you guys again next time. Take care. Peace out.